Welcome everyone, my name is Johnny Jorgensen. I'm out here playing my first round of the season here at Hampshire Country Club in Southwest Michigan. This is one of the only open golf courses right now, given we had snow on the ground about a week ago, and it's only 45 degrees out today, but the sun is out and the course is open, so let's get to it. We are starting off on the back nine today. Back is feeling really tight, but taking advantage of the weather, wanted to show you what bogey golf looks like. Early on, I used to think bogey golf was bad, but realistically, playing bogey golf is great for the weekend warriors out there. Take a look here. My first drive of the season is a big hook left uh, into those trees. Only traveled about 220 yards into trouble. But something I've always been told is, let's not have two bad shots in a row. So setting up here, I wanted to keep it low into these branches and hope to get a good roll out to the green. I ended up coming up short here, but short chip shot would give me a good look at par. Unfortunately, my putt didn't go in, but probably should have pulled the flag. Definitely blaming the flag oh, on that I one. Think that was the flag. Anyways, hole number 11 is a par 5 that goes right, then back left. Really needed this drive to fade off the tee. If I go straight or draw, I can easily end up through the fairway into trouble, and that's exactly what happened. This left me with no shot at all. The hole goes far left here and trying to avoid two bad shots in a row. Just need this out in the fairway. Got a little risky with this line, but luck was on my side. Getting out into the fairway, I got a good look to get on the green, the regulation about 170 yards out. I'm aiming about 10 to 15 yards right of the pine tree you see up there on the left. Because I'm hitting uphill, I clubbed up to reduce some of the natural loft of the uphill lie. Landing again, just short of the green, looking for a close chip for a good look at par. Ends up rolling out further than I wanted in a Ooh. tough putt here. Had the right line, just hit too soft, and I finished with another two putt, putting me at two over through two. Hole number 12 here is a straight par four. It actually drops downhill in the second half, which can give you a lot of rollout if hit well. Unfortunately, I pulled the drive left, but thought I was going to get lucky and miss the branches, but it at least knocked it down into the fairway. Shot number two, about 190 yards out, going downhill, taking my six iron, and I hit really fat, only going about 90 to 100 yards. Shot number three, 95 yards downhill, and again, my fear of going long left me short. See the club? Oh, just short. Guess it's chipping practice today. Get there. Maybe six foot putt here. Uh, I make for bogey. Ball got jammed by the flag stick there, but definitely went in the hole. Still tapping. Hole number 13 is a short par 3 uphill, 110 yards. Good size green, but a shot that is short on the left side can easily roll off and end 15 plus yards off the green. The back side is also trouble, so you need to be precise on this one. Made good contact here, just aimed for the left that I wanted, leaving me with a very long birdie putt. My thought here is just get close for a tap in par. Easy two putt for a par and we're three up. Uh, through four going into hole number 14. Straight par four here gets narrower the closer we get to the hole with some sand on the edges of the green. Again, I missed my drive left into the trees. Need to get that straightened out before the season gets going too far. That one's gone. Leaves me with another punch shot to get back to the fairway and try to get on the green with my third shot. Miss the my camera here, but thinking I'm 160 out, I take my seven iron. But again, landed short on the right side. This other gentleman on the course joined me as I was playing through and thought I hit this oh, one too much. long, Stop. but thankfully the ball checked up good on the green. Still about a 10 footer for bogey and just missed it. Oh. Oh. Yeah, pretty Teed off this short par five was a three wood since I have trouble with my driver. And this shot is hit really well with a small fade to the right towards the hole, exactly where I needed it here. Shot number two, I'm playing to lay up to give me a full wedge going into the green which is protected by more bunkers. Uh, so good contact here. Leave me with about 130 left, slightly downhill. Unfortunately, I aligned too far left and landed oh, in the side bunker. The I screwed up the camera angle again here, but uh, get out of the sand clean and got this putt for par, <laughs> which I miss. Leave me with another bogey. I am now six up <laughs> through six, heading into hole number 16 which is a long par three. Tried to muscle this one down there. I hit it fat and landed about 40, 50 yards short of the pin. Taking my wedge in, I've been hitting this well, uh, but when the ball lands on the edge of the green, like I wanted and planned, it checks up and just sticks right in place. Couldn't believe I had no rollout on the shot. Anyways, 
Long putt here. Uh, good line, just a couple inches short. Hole number 17 is a fun one. The hole continues uphill over the right fairway bunker. You see I'm aiming left of the bunker, looking to carry at least 240 to stay on that plateau. And I really stuck this one, finishing with about a 270 yard drive there. Shot number two is 106 yards uphill and I played the wrong wedge here. Too much loft with a little too much flick in the wrist. I sent this straight up in the air, landing right on the edge of the green. This uh, spot was challenging, being still very uphill. I need to remember to give it more power because I'm left short once again for a long par putt. And another bogey gets put on the books. Last hole to finish the round. Some wind in our faces, taking the driver out. Got a nice bait about 250 into the fairway. Let's finish strong here. 71 yards to the pin, 56 degree wedge. Do not want to end up short again going into this green. And a beautiful shot here. Looking at this birdie putt, I'm looking at this, you know, trying to finish strong, thinking two cups to the outside. Been putting decent, uh, haven't been too far off in my line. Just need to feel confident here. And I got the right line again, just too soft. That's been kind of my struggle today, just being short sided everywhere. Anyways, finish up the round today uh, with plus eight through nine holes. First round of the season, I'm happy with, uh, with that right now. If you're interested in following along in my journey, I'd likely be spending a lot more time this year playing Blackthorn Golf Course in South Bend, Indiana, which is a significantly nicer course. It has a lot more challenge to the holes as well. Their practice facility is top-notch, so stick around. Thanks for watching, guys, and looking forward to making some more content for you.